హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు విద్యా టీవీ ఈ పర్టికులర్ వీడియోలో టౌన్ ప్లానింగ్ అండ్ బిల్డింగ్ ఓవర్స్ ఇయర్ సంబంధించిన మోడల్ క్వశ్చన్స్ చూద్దాం డ్రాయింగ్ అండ్ సర్వేయింగ్ సంబంధించిన క్వశ్చన్స్ ఇవి సో ఈ క్వశ్చన్స్లో మనకు ఆన్సర్స్ కూడా ఇవ్వడం జరిగింది జస్ట్ గో త్రూ దెమ్ వెరీ మచ్ యూస్ఫుల్ ఫర్ ద ఎగ్జామ్ సో ర్యాండమ్గా క్వశ్చన్స్ అవుతాను క్వశ్చన్స్కి ఆన్సర్స్ కూడా ఉన్నాయి సో జస్ట్ గో త్రూ దెమ్ మెటాలిక్ టేప్ ఈస్ మేడ్ ఆఫ్ క్లాత్ అండ్ వైర్స్ ఫర్ అ వెల్ కండిషన్ ట్రయాంగిల్ నో యాంగిల్ షుడ్ బీ లెస్ దాన్ థర్టీ డిగ్రీస్ ద యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ ఇంటర్సెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ టూ ప్లేన్ మిర్రర్స్ ఆఫ్ అన్ ఆప్టికల్ స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ ఫార్టీ ఫైవ్ డిగ్రీస్ ద యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ ఇంటర్సెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ టూ ప్లేన్ మిర్రర్స్ ఆఫ్ అన్ ఆప్టికల్ స్క్వేర్ ఈజ్ ఫార్టీ ఫైవ్ డిగ్రీస్ నెక్స్ట్ వన్ ఈజ్ ద అలౌబుల్ లెంత్ ఆఫ్ అన్ ఆఫ్సెట్ డిపెండ్స్ అపాన్ ఆల్ ద ఫోర్ it depends upon degree of accuracy required method of setting out the perpendiculars and nature of ground and scale of plotting next question is which of the following angles can be set out with the help of french cross staff it is either 44 or 45 or 90 degrees next question is which of the following methods of offset involves less measurement on the ground it is method of perpendicular offsets involves less measurement on the ground next one the permissible error in chain chaining for measurement with chain on rough or hilly ground is what the permissible error in chain for measurement with chain on rough or hilly ground is it is 1 in 1 in 250 1 in 250 is the permissible error next one the correction for sag is always subtractive the correction for sag is always subtractive next cross staff is an instrument used for used for setting out right angles cross staff is an instrument used for setting out right angles next question normal tension is that pull which is which neutralizes the effect due to pull and sag which neutralizes the effect due to pull and sag which of the following is not used in measuring perpendicular offsets and uh, the answer is line ranger line ranger is not used in measuring perpendicular offsets next one if the length of a chain is found to be short on testing it can be adjusted by using what it can be adjusted by straightening the straightening the links if the length of the chain is found to be short on testing it can be adjusted by straightening the links next one the maximum tolerance in a 20 meters chain is what it is plus or minus 5 mm the maximum tolerance in 20 mm 20 meters chain is plus or minus 5 mm next one for accurate work the steel band should always be used in preference to chain because the steel band is practically inextensible and is not liable to kinks when is when in use so that is option c is the right answer for accurate work the steel band should always be used in preference to chain because the steel is practically inextensible and is not liable to kinks when in use next one the length of chain is measured from it is measured from outside of one handle to outside of other handle outside of one handle to other handle next one uh, what is the incorrect statement that means option a is an incorrect any chart so other three options are uh, true the true meridian at any place is not variable the true meridians converge to a point in northern and southern hemispheres the maps prepared by na- national survey departments of any country are based on true meridians so all these three are except a option a all the three are correct statements next one if the true bearing of a line ab is 269 degrees 30 minutes then the azimuth of the line ab is what it is 90 degrees 30 minutes so there is a formula for this i think everyone is aware of it in the previous videos we have uh, sorted 
this kind of solve this kind of questions next one in the prismatic compass the <clears throat> in prismatic compass we have the magnetic needles move with the box the line of the sight does not move with the box the magnetic needle and graduator circle do not move with the box here the answer is the four bearing of ab and back bearing of ab differ by 180 degrees that is the answer option a is the right answer next one right answer c is the right answer the magnetic needle and graduator circle do not move with the box the question is in prismatic compass the magnetic needle or graduator circle do not move with the box the other options are wrong next question for a line ab the four bearing of ab and back bearing of ab differ by 180 degrees the differ by 180 degrees next one local attraction in compass surveying may exist due to what local attraction in compass surveying may exist due to presence of magnetic substances near the instrument due to the presence of magnetic substances near the instrument in the quadrantal bearing system the whole circle bearing of 293 degrees 30 minutes can be expressed as what 293 degrees 30 minutes can be expressed as n 66 degrees 30 minutes west n 66 degrees 30 minutes west next question is the prismatic compass and surveyor's compass give whole circle bearing of a line and a quadrantal bearing of a line respectively the prismatic compass and surveying surveyor's compass give whole circle bearing of a line and quadrantal bearing of a line respectively next question the horizontal angle between the true meridian and the magnetic meridian at a place is called what the horizontal angle between the true meridian and magnetic meridian at a place it is called as declination it is called as declination next question a negative declination shows that the magnetic meridian is what a negative declination shows that the magnetic meridian is western side of the true meridian it is on the western side of the true meridian actually so these are some of the very important questions from surveying and drawing so very much useful for a town planning exam go through them ikkada answers kuda ivadam jarigindi questions plus options answers kuda ivadam jarigindi definitely questions help out ayi anukuntunanu right that's all for this video thank you